Hey crew, how are you this day? How are you? How are you? How are you? Okay, let's get a bit, bit of rocking, shall we? <laughs> hey, listen, guys, we. I'm going to come. I'm, what I've done is I've, uh, I've decided to come back with a little bit more of a, a second uh, tilt at the green screen uh, demonstration I did earlier. And I'm just going to flesh that out a little bit, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take us over to, to this one here. Now, what we've got here in this bottom screen, okay, is that if we're looking to do, because what I've got in this here, like in the screen up, up here, okay, this um, with my, uh, hang on, there we go. So you've got that screen there, this one here, which is the top one, like, what you can see is that's on a, uh, on the um, uh, multi, the, the <laughs> start again, Russ. Okay, that's on the green screen. Okay, so if I were to take you down here where everything happens here, okay, so here's where you opt to do the, uh, the chroma key in here. Okay, so what I'll be looking at doing is then what you do is that you if you're looking, this is the image, okay, that I'm working on, right, which is this second one down here, okay, here, uh, that's, I've got two, two, um, uh, two portions in there. So when you hit that chroma key, <clears throat> what you'll find, okay, is now, if I was just to turn that straight off now, you'll see mine, okay, now I go just straight back to the um, uh, uh, green screen behind me, like, okay? So if I was just to first set that up, you know, I just sort of go on, okay? Now, what it enables you to do is here in this, in this version here, right? Now, that background image, you can choose what you want, okay? You can make your own uh, choices in there. You can pull it in as a custom background, and that's what I've got on that one okay is a, is a custom background at this present time all right now the way you start this off is that you know you will this little dropper image here okay if you click that and then went into your um, uh, uh, selected section okay which obviously is this uh, this one here okay that we're working with Right now, I just I'm trying to get that green. See how I tick it, and that green goes out of it. That's exact how you start with it. But down the bottom here, what you can do is where these like you know essentially like uh, color wheels, but in a bar graph, are uh, you can you can subtly touch this up so that if it's a little bit, so like you can see a few places in there that it's uh, just a little little wobbly down this side you know, in here sort of thing, you know. So, you know, I could just sort of try and see if I hit that, I might come out of it. But what I might have to do is I might have to go back down to those. And you can see it's in the darker end, you know, of the scale. So you'd be uh, you'd be down here sort of thing trying to, and it's a bit hard with what the, <laughs> the actual, okay, see how, it, see how it's moving now? Okay, so... You know, like oh, I'm finding it very difficult to move it very fine with the recording and everything, but that's sort of how that works, okay? Now, also on top of there is what they call the shrink contour. Okay, using that, we'll, we'll, I'll, I'll demonstrate one. I've got to remember, it's pretty hard when it's only a magnification here for me. So if I was to move that out, see how it just cuts the image down a little bit, okay? All right. Okay, and you'll see there's um, bits uh, of of you know sort of the green color coming in behind my hairs, and if I overdid it, I'd pixelate myself right out. Okay, so the idea is just to get the, especially in this type of um, adjustment here, it's pretty it's pretty um, basic, you know. Uh, okay, so I mean, if you were into something like Venus uh, Vegas with the, you know the Boris um effects you know it's it's a lot smoother you know but this blur contour here okay that helps you just smooth out the edges a little bit you know so you can you know it doesn't look so quite so um 
uh, ragged, you know. So anyway, look, that's um, that's that's in the chroma key. Okay, so again, you know, you just hit up the chroma key. Okay, you go back through here to uh, you know whatever image you're working on. So uh, at the moment, I've got two and two, so I'm working on the top image. You set it off first with the color dropper to get out the background, and then you adjust it with your uh, you know your, your bar colors here. So, all right. Well, look. Uh, hopefully, <laughs> that uh, that works. Okay, you got something out of that. So, uh, again, please, you know, just sort of maybe uh, like like it if you if you do, and uh, let me know what else we we can work on. I'm going to go through now some more image backgrounds. Just just the things that I've found out how to make it work. So if that's something interesting, let me know. Otherwise, just, you know, let me know what you want to see. All right.